Hello, this is Michelle Nye, and this is the astrological update for Leo for the week starting the 22nd of August. Now, this week there's a lot of changes, but it's good because you can handle it because you're fully in your power. You're feeling deeply secure in your being. There may be a bit of an emotional tussle with someone, though, because you have Mars square Saturn, and there's a bit of push me, pull me with someone about responsibility. That's my peacock, obviously agreeing with the whole scenario. Anyway, Oberon, we're not interested. So this week, you've got to just be secure enough to know that you don't need to go into battle with someone that has a different view or idea about what you should do with your life. You have to go within yourself and to make a decision, particularly when it comes to your career. And that's because we have Sun and we have Venus saying to you, believe in yourself. The Sun is in the second house, the new Moon is in the second house, it's conjuncting Venus, the planet of love, and it's saying, believe in yourself and allow yourself to walk forwards in love, step into your power in love. And if you do that, there's very good news because Jupiter is saying to you, I am here to fulfill your wildest dreams when it comes to transformation around your career and a lovely aspect to Pluto. And it's not often we get lovely aspects to Pluto, um, but a trine to Pluto in the sixth house is saying, this is it. You are at a point of transformation and change. Do not let inner battles with yourself or outer battles with other people sway you from your path. You have to have faith in you. The second house is about you feeling deeply secure within yourself and knowing that really your decisions are yours. We are born alone, we die alone. We come here on a revolutionary soul adventure and along the way we have to make decisions that are great for ourselves. We can do that with love but we mustn't ever give our power away to allow other people to dictate our journey. Anyway, it's exciting. I send you much love and I'll speak to you soon.